This video is to show you how to set up a basic HTTP authentication with the Apache web server. Um, basically what it does is just creates a password protected folder which uh, you require a username and password set by you encrypted in a file on the server. Um, so it adds protection to stop anonymous people accessing the files. Um, the best way to do this really is to use a generator for the uh, passwords file uh, which stores the username and password in an encrypted form. Um, it also generates the HD access file um, which tells the server where to find the password file and the type of authentication um, for the users. So what I've done here is created a secure area which is protected with a password and a non-protected area so I can switch between and show you how it works basically. Uh, you can't actually see the HD access file or the password file because it starts with the dot uh, in Linux uh, Unix systems it's hidden from the end user but there's a way you can override that by pressing Control H and it'll show you the file which you can open in gedit um, so I'll best starting off with the HD access file so this is the HD access file for this particular uh, system uh, basically the authentication type is basic HTTP basic authentication uh, this is the name which will pop up with the pop-up box which asks you for the username and password you can change that string there to anything you want and this is the location to the password file in this case which is one directory back from this file, the HD access file um, you need the absolute directory from the root of the server uh, this is the absolute directory on uh, Fedora uh, core 21 um, basically the location where this file is is where it would ask you for the password on the server so I'll just do it and show you um, it's there, right there so basically secure area um, password protected area, that's what you the string which you passed in in the HT access file. So in this case, the username is user and the password is password. So when I press enter now, log into that, um, I'm accessing the secure area on the server which I've set up. Uh, oh, nope. So now this file here is actually protected uh, with the password. You can't access this not unless you've got the password in. Um, okay, so back a directory. This password, this file is not password protected. Anyone can access this. Um, even though you can't see the password file, it is, it is actually there in this directory because it doesn't actually send it out to the end user. You can't. The end user cannot access these files. Um, just because the configuration won't allow it. So, the passwords file. This is an encrypted form of the word, of the word password, and that's the user name. You can have multiple users in this file, which you can access this directory. This has been generated by a online program from a website which where are we? Okay, this website. This creates the um, HD access file for you, but I want to show you right now is the HD password generator. So, what you do is enter your username, and there's a lot of tools online to do this, and the password, which is password, creates the 
to read file and there we go you just copy that into the htx access password file and save it and make sure it is read write access permissions 640 I think uh, ok go on properties on that file uh, permissions uh, 640 which is read and write for, that, for the owner and read only for others and the group which makes it more secure and I think that's the same for the HD access that's 640, Chamart 640 uh, read and write, read only, read only ok right if you copy everything I've just done it, this will not work on a standard installation of the uh, Apache web server because there's one setting in the server which you have to change and I've got a window open I think somewhere which I'll show you uh, this is the configuration file for the Apache web server which is located on this system in this directory um, I've opened this up as root so it's not read only uh, if you find the block code which basically this block code this is the root directory of the HG well HTML documents on the web server and this configuration will be different from every system but basically by default allow override is set to none which means you will not be able to use HD access to override the default settings um, so basically sort of done here is just type in all and saved um, then gone to the terminal and restarted the service the HTTPD service basically this Apache web server service but it would be different on Windows or WAMP server or whatever you're using just restart the server because you don't, it won't change anything on the system until it's restarted with that file on the server. Basically, now that should work for every, well, for a lot of people. But there obviously might be problems with you, it's different systems, different setups. But here we go then. Just a quick scan of what I've done. Password protected. This is the actual script I'm doing. That file is not protected, it's just basically an HTML file, just note it's telling you basically not protected. And basically when you log in with the password stored in there and the username combination, it will access the secure area and this is a protected file. And this file tells the server not to access this directory unless you give it the password and username given in this file. Um, that is about it really I think. Um, you should be able to set up password protected directory. Um, just remember you need to put the absolute directory from the root of the server to the password file. You can't use absolute uh, relative which I tried. You can't do that which it should work but it doesn't on this case. Um, okay, that's everything I need to tell you really. You just you can add users on each line basically. Test uh, and you need to encrypt the password on what the online tool which I'll leave a link in one of the files, actually I'll leave a link in the uh, non password protected file. Uh, edit that. I'll leave a link to that tool I've been using. I'll probably put my own tool online on my website. Um, so this website is a good tool for making password protected directories on the Apache web server.
Один. Encrypt it for you and everything sorted out for you. Uh, just stick in a BR there. Um, save that. And that's all done. Any problems, just stick it on the comments.